Everyone shouts. In his temple. The rich shout. In his temple. The poor shout more. In his temple. Everyone shouts. In his temple. The youth shout. In his temple. The elderly shout. Everyone shout. You have prayed more than those who are in the forest. Because where the answers come from, heaven. God has taken you there. And what do you see there? Not Ugali. No, you don't, you don't see money there. In his presence. What is there? In his presence, there are no cars. In his presence, there are no houses. In his presence, there are no things. What is there? And when you enter that glory, when you enter that glory, I want to repeat again. There's no preacher needed there. If he has the gift of healing, let him go and look for those who are sick. Hear the sick say, they replace the sickness with glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Everyone means everyone. You can say it better than me. Say it like yourself. Hallelujah. And when you are so blessed, don't wait for me to tell you to shout. You have a job to do. You keep shouting yourself. When, when that brother shouts behind, when that brother shouts glory behind you, don't look back and say who is this. Mind your business. Wewe jali iliyokuleta. Utukufu. Hallelujah. Everyone shouts. Everyone shouts. Everyone shouts. Amen. Amina, Amina, Amina. Hallelujah. While, while you are standing, open your Bibles. While you are standing, to Psalm 29. Zaburi ni 29. Ile ile tu. Eh, verse 8. Mstari wa 8. The voice of the Lord shakes the wilderness. Ni sauti ya Bwana inatetemesha jangwa. The wilderness is unshakable. Jangwa kawaida haiwezi kutetemeshwa. Only the voice of the Lord can shake it. Ni sauti ya Bwana tu yaweza kuitetemesha. Because there are no trees there for you to see be it being shaked. But the voice of the Lord shakes it. Inatikisa. So if your world is a desert, today hear his voice and it will begin to bear fruit. Hallelujah. At the end of verse 9, his temple. In his temple. Everyone. Kila moja. Everyone. Wote. Not all people. Not all people. Sio watu wote. Kila moja. You alone. Wewe peke yako. Everyone. Kila moja. You alone. Wewe peke yako. Shouts. 
wanasema kila mmoja anasema unasema Today leo come with me to the presence of the of the father watana nami ndani uwepo wa Mungu where he is popote alipo there is no such a thing as a prayer warrior hapo hakuna mambo ya kuja kujigamba mimi ni shujaa wa maombi he doesn't want warriors maana yesu hatafuti mashujaa wa maombi he wants he wants worshipers yesu anawatafuta waabudu Don't listen to these preachers who come around here from South Africa saying shake heaven shake heaven. You can't shake heaven. Hauwezi tikisa mbingu hata kwako umeshindwa kutikisa. You can't. Hauwezi mbingu utaanzana nayo aje. It's a lie. Ni uongo. L I E. No uongo. Somebody will be tempted to say now you are opposing your friend. Kuna kuna you are opposing the If Paul was here. Kama Paulo wa Biblia angekuwa hapa. Would he allow this thing to be to be said in his church? Angekubali mambo kama hayo yasemwe atikutikiza mbingu kanisani mali yuko. Paul is not here. Paulo hauko hayuko hapa. Joka is here. Mimi niko hapa. Amina. I have a responsibility to warn God's people. Ninajukumu kuwaonya watu wa Mungu. Don't just look at television and then think ah, many people are following him. Usiangalie tu runinga kisha useme eh watu wengi wanamfuata huyu muhubiri. This must be a good preacher. What? Lazima awe muhubiri mzuri. You mean the more the people? Yaani unamaanisha watu wengi ndio wanaamua. Then he must be very special. Basi anaweza kuwa mtu speciali sana basi. Forgive me. Nisamehe bwana. Mungu hahesabu wingi wa watu kuonyesha mtu yuko sawa. Is not how many people follow you. Mungu hafuatani na wangapi wanakufuata. Is not the number that follows you. Sio idadi ambayo inakufuata. Jehovah is great. Yehova ni mkuu. Follow him. Mfuate yeye. Hear this. Sikiliza. In Samaria. Pale Samaria. Philip had a great pro- Philip had a big problem. Filipi Filipo akakuwa na shida kubwa sana. Great crusade. Alikuwa na mkutano mkubwa sana. Crutches left behind. Basi mikongojo ikaachwa nyuma. Will just left behind. Magari ya magurudumu yakaachwa nyuma. People be healed. Watu walikomeponywa. Then God says, Kisha Mungu akasema, Philip, Filipo, go to that road. Nenda kwa ile barabara, fuata ile barabara. That road there, go there, go. Ile barabara. Leave, leave this place. Achana na hapa. Go somewhere else. Oka hapa enda kwingine. We will show you. Nitakuonyesha. Then he sees an Ethiopian. Kisha huko jangwani akamwona muithiopia. On a horse. Akiwa amempanda farasi. He had come to Jerusalem to worship. Alikuwa amekuja Yerusalemu kuabudu. And and the Holy Spirit says. Na Roho Mtakatifu akamwambia, join him. Basi we mfuate. Run after him. Mfuate mbio. He didn't give him a farasi. Roho Mtakatifu hakumpatia Filipo farasi Philip, naye run Filipo run run Alimwambia Filipo wewe kimbia run wewe kimbia And God is telling you today Na Mungu anakuambia leo hii Don't envy those who have got cars Usiwahusudu usiwaonee wivu walio na magari There is a speedometer in you only can be taken care of in heaven Bwana anakuambia kuna kasi ndani yako ambayo mbingu peke yake inaiendesha And here imagine Nafikiria huyu ni Filipo. Philip is running down here. Anapiga mbio hapa kando ya farasi. And this man has got a cut. Na huyu towashi yuko kwa gari ambayo inavutwa na farasi. Is the those 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 farasis are very fast. Unajua wale farasi walikuwa na kasi ka They were royal farasis. Royal royal. Walikuwa kwa farasi wa kifalme. Not ordinary. Si wa kawaida wa kula ugali. Royal farasi ambao wamekuzwa train, train to run wamekuzwa na kufunzwa kufanya kazi ya kifalme Philip was not given another one Filipo hakupatiwa gari nyingine na farasi ya farasi na hawa join him aliambiwa ungana naye look at this man running down here hebu muangalie huyu muhubiri amepiga mbio hapa kana and there is this man on a cart na huyu jamaa naye yuko kwa gari inavutwa na farasi he come from Jerusalem 
He was reading what he got there. And Philip is saying, Do you understand what you are reading? Do you understand what you are reading? The man told him, Whoever you are, how can I understand this and unless this? How can I understand this and this? He said, Stop the Pharisee. Philip, come up here. Okay, let's go now. Do you see the miracles here? I want to tell you this. What you don't expect God to do, He will do today. He will do today. And don't ask questions. Your job is to say Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. There's a burden in your heart. You discover it is no longer there. There was fear in your heart. You discover you're no longer afraid. And when it comes to that, we have one word to say. Glory. Utukufu glory utukufu glory utukufu glory utukufu I have seen this glory I have seen this glory nimeuona huu utukufu three times in my lifetime mara tatu maishani mwangu once in Zimbabwe mara moja nchi ya Zimbabwe hapa ni Eldoret hapa Eldoret and somewhere else pengine pengine kokote believe you me when i saw it ni heru niamini wakati wote i thought no one is seeing it I told Doret. I had my sons there. So Joe Junior was trying to take photographs of me preaching. And his camera could not focus. Because the glory was in the house. The, the glory was in the house. James, the young one. James Yule Mdogo thought there must be fire here. He, he ran out to see if the house is on fire. He came back. There's no fire. The police officer was told something's wrong in that hall. Something's wrong in that hall. There's fire there. He came with his car and two of his fire people. When he came in, he said, yes, I see smoke. I see it, but go, where, the, where is the fire? As they went to see the fire, the glory filled them. They began to shout to them too. The glory. You can't pin that glory and then, and then uh, lie that you are really blessed. You are really. Here your degree doesn't matter. In glory, it is you who is involved. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I, I was born in Kisi. Nilizaliwa Kisi. Yamira. Yamira. Where men don't cry. Mali mwanaume ni mwanaume hakuna kulia. You can't see machozi ya mwanaume. Machozi na rudi ndani ya itoki inje. Mwanaume ya nafaa kuwa mukavu. Dio. Ni kukausha. Kama hiko nja. Kaa ngumu. Mimi ni mwanaume. Hmm. Kama hiko shida. Mwanaume. Mimi ni mwanaume. Vita ikija. Hmm. Mimi nita tasaidia watu wangu. Tapikania watu wangu. Mwanaume. Men don't cry. That's how we were brought up. That men ought not to cry. But you see, when it comes to the issue Excuse of me. God's glory, 
sio uwi hapana we are not crying like we are screaming machozi yuko lakini si ya uwi yes we have tears but it's not tears machozi yuko lakini si ya uchungu it is not machozi yuko lakini si ya uchungu yes we macho, have macho, tears machozi yuko lakini we have tears but ni, not because ya utukufu it is because of the utukufu. glory of god machozi ya utukufu it is tears because of the glory of god shout glory glory Again shout the glory. Utukufu. Don't let anybody tell you oh no you know that's too much word. Usikurusu mtu kuambia hai umezidi sasa pale umefika. Ati umeenda mbali sana. You can't go very far. Mbali. God is great. Mungu ni mkuu. You can only go as far as he has allowed you. Unaweza enda tu mbali.